it is outrageous. I believe somebody sent me an attempted defense yeah. by the, 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 the Mayans. That is indefensible. These people, they, I think, were pretty much well positioned in terms of public opinion. I believe they've lost that completely now with this sort of an action. And well, they should. I mean, it is absolutely indefensible. I want to make clear to them again that that consent judgment merely recognizes that they are entitled to certain rights. The rights, the nature of the rights is not spelled out. We have agreed we will set up some sort of a commission. We will hear from everybody, uh, all, all parties uh, in Toledo and elsewhere before we can come to a decision as to what their rights ought to be. In the meantime, for them to do something like this, they talk about their rights. What about that man's human rights? What about his rights as a Belizean? I don't know how on earth they can ever justify this. In my view, they've lost whatever moral high ground uh, they ever had. And I want to look carefully at it to see if any of them might not perhaps be criminally liable for what they did to, 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 to that gentleman. They say he built a structure since 2014 on the Ushbenka site. And they did this as a last resort. That's what their release says. Well, I don't know about that. I don't know about their site. What I know is tying up this man, falsely imprisoning him, uh, uh, physically assaulting him. That is absolutely intolerable. And I am telling you, I mean to, to find out from the appropriate authorities what, if anything, they mean to do about it.